ladies and gents, we had some stuff being dropped today on us. As it's less than two weeks leading up to the final shape, they've been dropping some articles every day. We got a Vidoc today, some exotic changes, however. In this video, there's one specific thing that I want to talk to you about. In the TWAB, at the very top of it, if you read it, you would have noticed this little bit right here. Get your pretty guns. And it reads as follows. Earlier this week, we increased the drop rates for brave weapons and trophies of bravery, as well as increased the reputation gains with Shaq. These increases will remain until Destiny 2 into the light ends on June 3rd. We know you are swimming in loot now and want to up the ante one more time before the limited edition versions of the brave weapons are no longer available. Of course, those are the shinies. We love shinies. Starting on May 28th, AKA next Tuesday, Bungie will be doubling the drop chance of limited edition versions of the Brave Weapons, AKA your shinies. So that combined with the increases they've already made to weapon and token drops, will give you a lot of opportunities to grab a few more shiny weapons with pretty rolls. Yes, so what this means is that next week, the entire community is going to have a shiny charm and have increased chances of getting these shiny weapons to drop. If you ever play Call of Duty, I remember those double XP weekends. We got a shiny charm week, a one and done week right before the final shape launches a one last push to get those shiny weapons. And for those who are not aware, Onslaught, the game mode itself, will still be staying along with the normal version of the Brave Weapons. Now, that being said, I hope you have some time next week to go ahead and make a push to get these shiny weapons. Some really good options to go for, of course, are going to be the Edge Transit GL. Get yourself an Envious Bait and Switch, Cascade Point Bait and Switch. You can get some real value out of that. I would highly recommend a Mountaintop. Great weapon in every capacity. The Hammerhead is amazing. Best LMG in the game. Game. Pulse rifles are going to be nasty next season, but that heal clip incandescent luminous howl is pretty dang juicy itself. All the weapons are good. None of the weapons are bad, but there are ones that are certainly better than others. Let me know which weapons you're going to be farming for the most next week with this final push to get them, along with your favorite shiny that you've gotten from Onslaught thus far to this point. Thank you so much for watching the video. You guys be safe, take care, consider subscribing. Thank you for 30,000. We'll see your beautiful faces in the next one. Adios.